Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's been way too long since my last solo RPG sim ep, so today we're gonna bring it back. And of course, since the Halloween event is currently live in the game, we're gonna be doing the new Halloween Manor Raid with Fake Shasko. So, the only good thing I got going for this character is the max level pet. My gear is very okay at best. As you guys can see, just some crafted EOT stuff and a Realm of Shadow Sword. I don't even have Infinity, so we're gonna be struggling in there and we're gonna be using Flame God which is definitely not the best way to go, but we're gonna try our best. Now let's see if we get lucky. The worst part about this raid, in my opinion, are these, oh God. Oh, we do like no damage. Dude, we're struggling to even kill the pillars. So that means the bosses themselves are also gonna not die very quickly at all. And wait, how much health do I have? Okay, we got 73 million health. At least our health is pretty good. Oh yes, there we go. Okay, we're in, we're going, we're going. And right off the bat, they're already spinning and flipping around and I can't tell what's going on. We're already about to die. What's going on? We're just, uh, what? What do you mean, nice try, man? What am I supposed to do against these guys? How is this so easy on my other character? I like didn't die at all. Just run away. No, run away, get out of here. Get out of the spin of death. No, I can't move. I can't move, I can't tell what they're doing to me. Every second, the entire ground is just red with death. You do the goofy grab attack, you do the goofy spin attack, and I'm just gonna put this down in the middle and hope it damages you. Wow, that actually that actually worked pretty well. Dude, I can't tell how to dodge. How do I dodge? How do I dodge the whole map at once? Okay, we're gonna need to uh, go back in there with a different game plan. So we're gonna go with Lunar instead and maybe try a ranged spam strategy. Maybe if I just keep on backpedaling away from them, I can just kill them from afar. Is that better already? Please be better. I can't see your health bar, Mr. Statue. How much health do you have? Bro, where's your health bar? Where's your health bar? How are you not dead? What, uh, I, okay, well, uh, I think that was faster. I don't really know. Starting, we're beginning. So, oh my God. Dude, when they get started on the floor, I just don't know how to, dodge them and I don't have inferno or anything so I can't cheese them where they just you know kill me and then I just get invulnerable for a little bit I can't do that on fake sc dude bro what do you mean what do you mean I'm dead what am I supposed to do how good am I supposed to this is a level 1200 raid and this is like 76 times harder than EOT on normal or realm of the shadows which are both higher level raids Eve okay Hold up. Maybe Lunar is just really not the way to go in here. I mean, maybe I am just this weak. Maybe I am just this bad with this character. I mean, I know Fake Shosko's pretty weak, but there's just, dude, there's just no way. Just kill me. There's just no way. They, they do so much damage to me, and I do so little damage to them, and every single time I get up in their faces or even try to attack, I just die. Flame God was doing the damage, at least it was doing some, some decent-ish damage, but unless we can survive for more than like the 10 seconds that we can survive in there, I think we're not gonna be able to do this with fake Shosko. Okay, I know we, we just were using Flame God and it didn't go great, but we're gonna use Flame God again. We're gonna do one last run, one more run with Flame God this time. And if this goes poorly and I just get murked and die immediately again, I'm gonna come to the conclusion that Haunted Manor it's an incredibly difficult raid unless you're using the Inferno Sword, which lets you die and come back without dying for a while. It seems like without that or Zephyr or any of the like actual good runes, we're not gonna be able to do this. Cause one thing that shocked me was a lot of you guys commented on my last video going like, hey Shosko, the Haunted Manor isn't that easy. You said it was easy, but I can't beat it at all. I know what you guys are saying now. I feel ya, this is a, a bit of a struggle. We got lucky that they spawned in on after like what the second statue anyways uh now we initiate the try not to die challenge okay you're there you're doing your little spooky dance and then you do that okay i, I just don't know the right times to come in and attack is it now oh that seemed pretty good oh well that did that did nothing to him he still has like over 99 percent hp i got excited for nothing Okay, maybe this time. Come do your little spooky dance. There you go. Do that. Do that. And then I can't move. I can't move. I'm dead. Jimmy, thanks for complimenting me on my try. I just can't do it. I'm only going slightly crazy because I don't think... I'm dead. I'm dead again. I'm dead again. Bro. Oh my god. So what it's looking like. 
what it's looking like. If I want to beat this raid with fake Shosko, I'm going to have to get a tier 6 pet gem. I'm going to have to get the rune of the Zephyr. And I'm also going to have to get the Rune King gear, and the Inferno Sword, and probably mainly the Inferno Sword, because I need that crazy thing where you come back from the dead and not die for a little while, and you just get a crazy amount of damage off. And we, and, and I know some people are probably going to be like, Shosko, why aren't you using Havoc and Calamity at the same time? Well, if I were to use Havoc in here, I'd just die. I would just die immediately, because I don't have the Inferno Sword to keep me alive after I pop my Havoc. Dude, we're going to die again. They, I've done nothing to them. No, 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 no. Oh, we're good. I've done nothing to them. And they've done everything to me. Maybe this time. Maybe this time. Come on. No. Okay. Well, you know, I'm not really too sure what to try at this point. It does kind of feel like I'm not going to be able to finish this raid without the this gear. I need this gear. I need this stuff. The Inferno Sword and the Rune King gear. I don't need this terrible, terrible EOT gear. I'm going to end the video off here, not because I want to, but because I, I just don't think it's literally possible for me to beat this raid with fake Shosko, not without getting a ton of new gear and a tier 6 pet gem and, and the Inferno Sword and just everything I could ever need. Anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching this video. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe for more, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.